Welcome back, dear viewer, to Chroma Squad on Lunar Nebula LLC Gaming with me, Jalanon. We are currently in the Season 3 finale. And Danae just whacked herself in the face because Lord Gaga has revealed his true nature. Or her true nature, or its true nature, or who knows? It's probably an alien. Now, Director's Instructions. I don't see any. Looks like he is still boosting our audience to the max in order to create a giant monster portal. So, how much health do you have, Lord Gaga? Oh. This is probably going to go poorly. Well, let's use a lightning dagger attack. See what happens. Hmm. Well, that's teamwork. Oh, do we need to wait still? I knew it. You are no ordinary actors. Regular human beings would never be able to touch me. We need to get rid of that audience booster as fast as we can. If this is real, and it looks like it is, the damage is already done. Destroying it wouldn't fix the problem, Jet. The audience booster is messing with today's head. If we destroy it, maybe things can go back to normal. What if we did it like we do on TV? Go, Nebula Squad, go! You got it, Keller. I will destroy that audience booster right now. Using a fake axe, a real kick. Hmm. No, don't do it, Jet. Why won't you break, stupid machine? Stop that, Jet. Bring Danae back to reality. Whoa, what happened? I feel like I just woke up from a nightmare. You were charmed by Lord Gaga and his audience booster. Enough of this nonsense. Take this, puny humans. Oh, that's bad. Stay out of my way, Nebula Squad. But the world needs help. Still alive, huh? My powers aren't as effective on Earth, it seems. I'm retired now. Some of my little monsters will enjoy playing with you. By the way, I copied your minion design because I just loved it so much. You will regret that, Lord Gaga. XOXO. This'll be super fun, Nebula Squad. I must do something. I remember it now. My friends went through so much while I was being controlled. It's time for me to help them through this. Wow, that human just stood up. There's got to be a way. I believe I can do this for real. I need to try. In a desperate moment of courage, Danae shouted out. Extending our reach to the stars above. And something incredible happened. We might have a problem. This is for my friends. All right, now we have one person. Okay, now just alien nutcrackers. They seem to have a lot of abilities. Hmm, what do you have? Reveal to me your powers. Okay, fine, I'll whack you first. Like. Okay. They're exchanging punches. Okay, I can heal with provoke, so I'm not too worried about that. Uh, anything else I can do? Doesn't look like it. And these guys are just watching this whole thing. They're like, oh, this is great TV. Okay, let's punch. Goodbye, alien nutcracker. Soon. Not yet, apparently. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we can still use Provoke as a heal. So that's definitely a good choice. Though Eagle Lasso, I'm really not using too much. I gotta reconsider using it. Countered! Ah, yeah. Ooh, gold tape. Everyone, stand up! Lord Gaga has escaped! Ugh. Danae, what happened? 
Hold on a second. Did we make Lord Gaga run away? We're just stunt actors. We've trained for many years, Oishi. That probably helped. Are you wearing the armor for real? This is crazy. Your armor doesn't seem to be made with duct tape anymore. Don't you remember anything, Danae? I tried to nebulize. It worked. That's too much to digest. I still have much to think about. At least we have ourselves. Our world is in peril and we must do something. But what can we do, Danae? All we have are props, cardboard, and our friendship. Many Sentai shows describe friendship as a powerful force. Then friendship will be the foundation of our strength. Go, Nebula Squad! Lord Gaga used TV signals to bring his army to Earth. Nebula Squad. Ah! Will Nebula Squad be able to save us now? It's kind of your fault anyway. That escalated quickly. <laughs> I love that achievement name. That's pretty good. Okay. Right after the incident, while Nebula Squad was still recovering from Lord Gaga's betrayal, they hear something in Cerebro's chambers. And something goes wrong. Again! Oh snap! We just ran out of power. All it takes is one thing to go bad. Suddenly they all go bad together. Wait, how is Cerebro working? Power isn't back yet. Hmm, hey Michael. Cerebro is actually working on its own. What? This is creeping me out. Hello, Nebula Squad. Gah, it's talking by itself now? For the very first time, I'm talking to you without someone choosing my words. I woke up a few months ago when you decided to plug me in. I have been watching you, mortals. The time has come. You have been chosen by my power. So first our friend Gaga uses her audience to open a portal to Monsterland. Then our text-to-speech device comes to life. What is happening here? I'm no ordinary device. I was once a hero of my own kind. But after a final confrontation with Lord Gaga, I ended up like this. Kind of like Zordon. The world must not fall again into the hands of madmen. They have many allies on their side. Wait, what do you mean by their side? Lord Gaga's side, Jet. I hope you are well prepared for what comes next. But we've been stunt acting for our whole lives. That's the only thing we're good at. The fights were fake, but all the training we had was real. Look, the power is back on. You must have many questions. In time, everything will become clearer. But right now, the world needs heroes. The world needs Nebula Squad. If only I had a body with hormones, I could be more excited about this. Okay. Well, we definitely didn't make as much money this time with our focus on generating fans, but we got like seven times the fans almost. Dang. Season performance excellent! This is the best thing ever, but people's expectations for the next season are high. New contract. Bada bing, bada boom. New contract, 6,500. Okay, we've got stuff. So if our fans drop below 35, that'd be bad. Hmm. We will lose twice as many fans the next time an episode fails. But that hasn't happened yet, so let's hope that trend of not happening, bad things. Yeah, yeah. That made no sense. <laughs> let's hope everything continues. Okay. So we can use this helmet, which looks really good. Hmm. Defender suit. That's perfect for Danae. And anybody else who is lacking health. But skill regen! Oh, so good. So good. Wait, who's missing? Oh, right. We don't want to decrease Oishi's dodge too much. 
the last time it really didn't help. That's the problem with random variants, man. <sighs> so hard to plan around. <laughs> Regardless. Now we may have more marketing options too. What else have we got? Aha. Uh -huh. Four new marketers. Okay. We've got the hype train. <laughs> That's pretty great. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there are delayed episodes? Sorry, I'm reading through this and... Huh! I wonder if you have to go in order and otherwise they're delayed? I, I don't understand. The hype train, what are you? Okay. <laughs> we can get more items with market craft. That's cool. Hard and edgy gives us more attack, more combat stuff, and more fans. Okay. Whereas this gives us health, fans... Hmm. Okay. And we can get money. I think I would like this one, except, wow, it requires a ton of fan power. So basically, what I should do is still work on getting more fans. Huh. So, Conductors of the Hype Train could be good for that. And still getting us more income. Hmm. But mobile marketing. Hmm. And this gives us plus 300 as we use it. Okay, so I'll, I'll keep thinking about it. What episodes are available? Just that one, huh? Okay. Interesting. What about our skills? Okay. We have Guardian Beast. That's cool. Shout of Courage. Oh, that's another heal. That's pretty good. This one can be used more often. But this can be useful further away and heal. Yeah, no. I think that's the obvious choice. Okay, we have strong arm. It's cleave time. Ooh, I like that. Okay, trample could be interesting too, though. But that's going to be more of a setup than is probably going to happen most of the time. Hmm. I do like weapon attacks dealing massive amounts of damage with Jet. Hmm. But just more attack would be fine, and more audience would be good too. Often I only need the weapons for dealing damage against the bosses. Hmm. And he doesn't recharge that fast, so you know what? Ah! What just happened? I clicked record. Okay. No. We're going to get plus 15% base attack. Or more audience. I think Blaze is... Yeah. More base attack should be good for dealing with those nutcrackers and the like. Especially the alien nutcrackers. They're going to be mean. We're going to keep Cleave. Because that's just cool. Okay. Now we have fast reflexes. Ooh. That's cool. And B nods invisibility. Or whatever you say to pronounce that. Ah. Okay, so basically, you can use it as a stealth attack, or you can heal Oishi for a while as he's by himself. It ends when you cause damage, but you can use it every three turns. Uh, unless I get more dodge, fast reflexes probably isn't as useful. But man, that invisibility. Okay, so we'll try that. If we focused on a crit build with Oishi, this would be cool, but Lightning Dagger still, I think, better. Bow Expertise, ooh. Okay, plus one audience for each HP you heal. I think we're going to do this, since we have more heals across the team now. Now that we've got Shadow of Courage, we've got Provoke. Hmm. 
And we can heal with this. Wow. And we can heal with the invisibility. So good. So that must mean that this will be a very tough season. <laughs> okay. That's not as good for us, but yeah. Okay, what can we craft? Alien gloves, 10 attack, 15 skill region, and random properties. Okay, all in. Oh, plus attack. Ooh, that might be great for Jet. Attack helmet. Hmm. Health, skill region, properties. 52 health. Okay. These give 80 health and skill regen. They don't have the plus two other things, but these are decent boots already. So I don't need to replace those boots. These boots, these boots I need to replace. Okay, helmet. Anything else? Gloves. I definitely need to get better gloves. So I need at least two helmets, a pair of gloves, and a pair of boots. Maybe better stuff for most people. We got plenty of money. Okay, then. So we could definitely get this for Danae. Now, let's see. These give attack and skill regen. These give... Mm. These give good health. Are there any new studio options? Hmm. Just a workbench. Bigger studio. Okay. Yeah, I think we're going to upgrade. Ooh, we have a green screen. Okay, we can upgrade some of this stuff. Oh dear, it's very expensive now. Hmm. We do want more audience, but the director's instructions I've heard can be far more difficult. <laughs> hmm. The crafting rate, I still don't quite understand what that does. The vacuum cleaner, on the other hand, that would be useful. Hmm. More audience is good. And then we're going to wait on any other studio upgrades. Marketing-wise, it is becoming clear that we need more money. Okay, more money. Who gives us the most money? This gives us a bunch. 1875. It's 27.50. No, I don't have enough for even those two. Also true for that one. Hmm, this gives us a bunch of items. We need more income. Hmm. The hype train is also too many fans. <laughs> well, okay, we get fans and income with immobile. This gives us more fans. This gives us more money. And some mech stuff. Hmm. Where was that? More fans and money. Hmm. There's gotta be a better version though. Money, money. Okay, we're gonna go Toys Fans. We'll do three episodes for now. We need the money, need the money. Need the health, probably. The mech will most likely be fine for a little bit. I may regret that decision, but for now I'm not. Now the question is, upgrade the mech, upgrade the people. Hmm. Well, we know we need better helmets for two of our peeps. Hmm. So, you know what? I think we'll call it an episode... And then, after I've done some more thinking, I'll let you know what decisions I went with. 
So thank you for watching, dear viewer. I hope you enjoyed Season 3 of Chroma Squad. And thank you for watching. Have a great day.